Yo there guys, what is up Blue Games and today we are playing Terraria 3D Edition and today we have our first pair of wings since last episode. Now since last episode I have also been doing a couple of things and I did manage to get myself a room wizard robe. And a rune wizard hat. I also managed to get myself a mechanical skull. I can't remember if I got that on video. I think I did. But I made all my um, ores into bars. And I've got a couple of other things. Like the iron skin potion. Things like that. Now I've been looking up and doing some research. And I've just remembered off the top of my head. That if I mix uh, the boots. Where are they? Right. Hermes boots. I've got a pair of these. If I mix these rocket boots at Tinkerer's workbench. Then I can make the... What, wait, well, what are they? I need add, I can't even remember the name of them, so never mind. Right, there we go. I can make the Spectre Boots. So we can craft some of those, and they're going to be good. I like the Spectre Boots. They're good. In my opinion, they're great. So the wearer can run super speed. So super fast speed, and that could probably replace the flying carpet. Uh, maybe. I don't know. But I'm thinking it can replace flying carpet. Anyway, and I think we do have a pair of ice skates as well, which will allow us to make the Spectre Boots think or the ankle of the wind as well i need i don't know if i got one of those but that's from the jungle biome they're easy to get right okay let's have a look do we have ice skates or the ankle of the wind i do remember getting it on one of the editions but i can't remember if it was this edition or not i totally can't remember so i've got no new additions for buildings i do need to do another building as well so that more npcs can move in i was so positive that i got ice skates on these don't know. But yeah. No, wait, 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 wait. What's that? Oh, a jungle rose. That's not going to be any good, is it? Anglet of the wind is what I need. So yeah. There we go then. We do need... Ah, oh, we do... Do we do actually have another chest, don't we, in our inventory? I think so, anyway. Yeah, we've got two gold chests. There we go. So I've got a load of potions as well from exploring. And I've been trying to get adamant type, but I just can't get it. I worked out that I need like 40 odd bars. So what my plan is to make a brand new world and go in it. And then once we've got that brand new world, we'll uh, go from there. Right, let's put some of the things in here that we don't need then. So we're not going to use the chain knife. We're not going to use that. We're going to use those. Feathers. Uh, platinum ores. Nah. I mean, we're not... We're, we're, this this vanity is nice. I'm going to use it. I'm going to wear it. Forget it. I'm using it. Right, you know, I think I have to equip it first, don't I? It's so weird on Android Edition that you're on 3DS Edition, not Android. What am I talking about? Yeah, Android Edition. That you have to first equip it, then put it in your inventory. And then from there, you have to equip that as your armor. Which is so strange in my opinion, I don't know. But oh my god, we look amazing. We look amazing. We do. We do, we do, we do. So we're going to go in here and shove that. Oh god. Going to shove that in there. Put those in there, those in there. We don't need them, do we? I was going to say, wait, do I need those? But I don't. Uh, we'll keep that on just in case we need to go into war. We don't need that for now. Uh, we don't need the flesh catcher, but I'm going to keep it on me. Some things I will keep on me. I'll make exceptions, okay? Right. So, the first thing we need to do is now load up into the world. And we're going to go over to that world because this world is actually a small world, believe it or not. I've made a world. I don't know if it's crimson or corruption. Prefer it if it's crimson because it will be adamantite, I think. Not sure. Actually, I'm not sure if the, 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 the corruption of the world plays a part of which one you get. Hmm. Anyway, I made this new world called Alugaji. I don't know why I called it that. Just just did. It's an expanded world this time, though, so that um, I can actually go the full way. First thing, we're going to look for ice skates, and then we'll go look for an anklet of the wind. Which I think the anklet of the wind is just from a jungle biome in chess. What I love that effect. That effect is amazing. And I've noticed something. Trending topic on this thing. We have actually got every single guide NPC name to start off with called Jeffrey. Which is super strange. I don't know why. It's just such a random thing. Right, we do have wings. And we can fly super speed with these. So they don't go very high though. That's the problem. That's the problem. I wish I had better wings. But yeah. We do have a flying carpet as well to, you know, give us a little bit of extra oomph. Of uh, speed. So that's all good. That goes forever. That the, the flying carpet is literally a lifesaver for speed. I'm not even joking. Ah, we got corruption. We got corruption. So seeing as we do have corruption, let's get. Let's give it a hit. Let's uh, give the corruption a, a tap. Here we go. Right, we're, we're gonna try and kill the Eater of Worlds in a record. No, not a record time. We're gonna try kill the Eater of Worlds. And with that, rapid healing would like to settle down. I thought I said rapid healing would like to settle down. That's like, huh? Anyway, um, it said rapid healing active, but here we go. 
We haven't yet killed the uh, Wall of Flesh on this world, so we can't destroy the altars. Horrible chill goes down your spine. It's all good. I just want to see if we can get the pet, to be honest. If we get the pet first time, I'll be amazed. It's the only reason I'm doing this for the pet. It's the only reason I want a uh, corruption world. Just for the pet. Purely. There we go. Beautiful. Taboo Vile Fawn. Taboo. What's taboo? Didn't even know that was a... Uh... Ah. Taboo Vile... Is that the full name of it? Or is taboo the uh, modifier? I think it's the modifier, right? Never heard of taboo before. Maybe it's just because I don't make many we uh, magic weapons. I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it's not. But the Vile Fawn's a great weapon. Not gonna lie. If you're early on in uh, hard, mo um, hard mode, if you're early on in the game, even, very good thing to have. Right, shuriken. A new recipe has been unlocked. Ooh. I think that's because we've got worm teeth, didn't we? Right. The Each of Worlds is awoken. Dun, dun, dun. Let's kill him. But I can't see anything down here. I thought I said the Each of Worlds is dead then. I was like, huh? Already? Here we go. He's just, he's just going to die super easy anyway. Is he dead? Is he still alive? Oh, there, there, there's the rest of him. He's going to die no problem though. Here we go. We have literally taken no life pretty much off us. We are destroying him. Okay, that's that's about, probably about a 20, 30 seconds kill. How long is he? Stop. Ah, oh, there we go. Ear of Worlds has been destroyed. Do we have enough inventory space? We do. So if we did get anything, we would have got it then. Yeah, we, did, we didn't get anything, did we? <laughs> well, that's a shame. Well, there we go. Anyway, I was hoping to get the pet, but just didn't happen, did it? Just didn't happen. But there we go. We have now killed... The uh, Heat of Worlds, which is the very first time kill. Oh, we can kill another one. Because cause, just because they're so close together, we're going to go for the next one too. Why not? Beautiful. And I love being in uh, pre-hard mode. It makes me feel like so good. It makes me feel like uh, a grandmaster of the game. It makes me feel like Happy Days or a Python GB. Not a nice bit of Miss the Epic Ninja here, guys. We're going we're gonna to be, we're gonna be uh, your mate before we know it. No, I'm just joking about that joke. Your mate is just too OP. Band of Star Power. Ooh, that's good. We don't... We, we, have, we got a Band of Regeneration. We don't. So that means if we do get one, we can make the Band of uh, Regeneration and Star Power. And I can't remember what that's called. I think it's Band of Healing, maybe, or something like that. I don't... I don't remember. That's what we need. And an Eater of Worlds has awoken. Let's see how fast we can kill him this time, then. Where is he? Come on. Give me the pet. There he is. Oh, we can take him out, no problem. Look, look at that copper coin. It's just going up and up and up. 720. Okay, it did lose the momentum because we sort of uh, got hit. But we are just destroying him. I think my robes sort of light up the area a little bit, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, what I'm seeing on the screen is really dark. But on the actual game capture, it don't look too dark. But it still looks dark, I'll tell you that now. Knee of Worlds has been destroyed. Yes. Now I can go about my day-to-day -day business of being a noob. Oh, well, there's another one. We're not going to go for it, though. Screw that. Nah. Forget that. Yeah, it is. It, it, I knew it was a modifier. Let's keep going, then. Screw him. Let's go. <laughs> not a very good word, really. Let's keep moving on, anyway. This this even stone brick is so hard to break, as well. Oh, yeah. I was going to see if there's any uh, ice biome, weren't I? Hmm. I need to go see if there's any ice biome actually still. Normally it's quite close by to this biome I see. Ooh, I see another. Whoa, that's so weird. There's two. There's three. This is such a weird, weird spawn. I'll tell you that now. This is so strange. Don't think I've saw three before right next to each other like this. Wow. Did we just get a lucky spawn rate or something? Who knows? Who knows? Destroy the first one. Destroy the second one. And destroy the third one. Band of star power again. There we go. And he's well. Oh, we got the light bulb. That's good. The light bulb. The light source even. The light bulb. <laughs> the light bulb. Yeah, legit Luke. Legit is a light bulb. We got the light bulb guy. <laughs> Shadow orb, that's it. It does provide a source of light, right? Yes! We have a source of light now as well. Wonderful. I mean, it's sort of... It isn't very good source of light, but it, it works. It works. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. Bit faster. Bit faster. 
can take him out no problem as well. I like how we can take him out no problem. I like that. I like that a lot. Right, three, two, one, and he's dead. Hey, we timed that a bit right, didn't we? Is he going to drop anything? Let's take a look. We don't need all these muskets. Let's trash them. They're not worth any money. Let's be, let's be honest. They're not going to sell for a lot. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of the worm teeth because we're not going to use them. And we've got a precise band of star power. Wow. Wonderful. We still have a space, so that means we haven't got anything else. Well, we do have a sort of a light source now, so when we do go down caves like this, we should be all sorted. Good, good, good. Ooh, actually, one thing is, while we're in the jungle, we could potentially get the, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, I'd, lo I'd, I'd love it if we did get the anklet of the wind out of the first one. Let's take a look anyway. Oh, we've got a bee pet. Should we take it? Nah, the tiffer's rubbish. Well, it's not. It's quite cool. Yeah, I want to take it. <laughs> I like the tiffer's rubbish. Uh, let's take it. Inventory is full. Okay, let's uh, get rid of these. Get rid of this as well. You can just tap it in. But I always... There we go. Tapped in. Right now, let's take it. Beautiful. We've got the beeswax. Does look a bit... Does look quite nice, to be fair. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. We don't need any of those. Just looking out for any more uh, any more jungle chests so we can potentially get the anklet of the wind. It'd be nice. Okay, what what's the point of two magic mirrors in a chest? Never understood that. Two magic mirrors in a chest. There's literally no point. Hey, here we go. We got another. We got another one here. Hey, we got some gold there. We'll take that. We'll take those, and then we we'll keep we we'll keep plodding on. Let's keep plodding on. Let's see if we can get a load of these. I want to get a load. Ah, yes, it's too beautiful. Anklet of the wind, please give me a. Staff regrowth, don't want that. Gravitation potion, we'll take it only because we have some honors. I know we got some honors. Oh, hey, we got the petronage. Oh, yes, we got a, we got a slime. I want to take that. I don't know why, but I do. There we go. Right. We, we, our inventory is full again. Well, let's get rid of that. We'll get rid of that, and let's take this. Yes. Should we take anything else? We'll take the life. Uh, not our potion. And we'll use one of these just because, just in case it gets a bit dark. And yeah, our quest to get all the pets is quite going quite well. I mean, it's not an official quest, but I do want to do it eventually. Um, yeah, Splunk Potion. We'll take one of those because Splunk Potions always come in handy anyway. Let's put that there. There we go, beautiful. And wait, we'll take the life as well. Why not? While we're at it, mines as well. Need a bit of healing for us. Beautiful. Hey, what's that? Okay, not what we want. Is there any more of those things? Hey, there is. And we've got the mushroom biome. Don't like that biome. Pretty, ah, edgy biome there. There we go. We've got some light source there too. Beautiful. Come on, man eaters. Nothing, nothing on me. More like noob eaters. <laughs> no, that was bad. What's this? Is that a blank? Is that a blanket of ore? Is that silver? Oh no, that's just stone. I was like, is that a blanket of silver ore? Looks so look so much like it. Hey, recoil potion. I haven't saw one of those for a while. Yeah, we don't need none of the other things. But let's take a, a quick a quick look. If there's anything, hey, we do. We have one. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Come on, anklet of the wind. Anklet of the wind. Boom. Oh, we got a feral claws. Which we're probably not going to use. Thorns potions are good to get as well. We're collecting a lot of potions here, guys. It's a, uh, it's like a trend. Collecting tons of potions. Right, did we choose spikes? Do we need those? Anvil, but we definitely don't need that. Right, let's take that. I think I'll take these and these. Let's go. Oh, yeah, feral claws. They actually might be good to equip. 12% melee speed, you see. Which means I can swing my sword faster. But what would we swap it for? 15% increase melee, 4 defense, tide climbing claws, but it's clear. Yeah, we're not, we're not going to swap it out for anything. Forget it. We don't need to. Just look around. To get, we, can we find any more? Maybe? Possibly. Hey, there we go. Ankle of the wind, please. I'm pretty sure you get them from these anyway. I'm like convinced you do anyway. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm What? Imagine if I am wrong. I would be. I'd just. Uh, no, I'd, I'd just be done. I'd be like, nope, that's it, guys. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. 
Hey! Oh my days! We got a lot of stuff. Vile of Blood will take that as well. Why not? While we're here, we might as well take it. We might as well. Let's get trash that. We were Oh, 90 rotten chunks. Are you kidding me? Wow, that's a lot of rotten chunks there. I didn't think you got that many. We finally got the anklet of the wind. That's good. Now all we need is um, some ice skates. 